is up guys? This is Patrick Kura, your prof next door. So for today's video, gagawin po natin yung first ever acrylic painting. And ituturo ko po sa inyo kahit hindi pa po ako ganun kagaling magpaint. So kung paano po ba yung mga stroke, paano po ibiblend yung mga colors and ano yung mga gagamitin po natin mga gamit. Okay? So sa mga hindi pa po, po nakasubscribe dyan, go to my YouTube channel Patrick Kura and hit the subscribe button and the bell notification. So, let's start our session. So, ano ba yung mga gagamitin natin kapag nagpipaint? Of course, kailangan po natin to para magmukha tayong expert. No? <laughs> yung punti na tawag nating easel. Pag sinabi pong easel, ito po yung kahoy na magsusupport sa ating pong canvas. No? And syempre, feeling uh, ano po tayo expert. Then, we have our canvas uh, board. Ayan, dito po natin ipipaint yung pong ating pong um, object mamaya and then we have our um, palette yan, ang tawag po dito ay palette may iba't ibang klase ng palette may metal, may wood yung gamit ko po is plastic palette pero kung kulang po sa budget pwede po kayong gumamit na lang ng pinggan yung hindi ginagamit o kaya yung pong uh, alam nyo po yung sa ref, yung para sa mga ice cube na hindi ginagamit, pwede nyo po pong gamitin yun as an improvised palette then we have here our um Paint brushes, yan. So, iba-iba po sila. Meron po tayong round. Yan, ito po yung round po natin. Yan, round. E, this is number 6. Then, we also have another round. Round brush. This is number 4. Tapos, meron po tayong tatlong flat na paint brush. Yan, so, ano yung mga number nito? We have number 6. We have number 2. And we have number 8. Okay. Nung una, akala ko yung brush pare-pareho lang. Iba-iba pala. May iba-ibang shapes, may iba-ibang um, sizes, and iba-ibang um, ano po siya uh, sa dulo. Kung mga to yan, flat, round, meron pa po iba yung filbert na tinatawag. At saka yung naka-spread out na brush. Then we also have over here our... Um, paint. No? Ang gamit po natin for today is acrylic paint. May iba-iba po tayong mga colors here. We have Chinese white. We have primary lemon yellow. Primary red cadmium. Al alizarine crimson. English light green. Blue turquoise. Cerulean blue. Or cerulean blue. Cobalt violet. We have here your burnt amber. And you have your ivory black. Yan. So, as you can see, meron po tayong mga uh, earthly colors. So, yun yung tawag natin neutral colors. Ito po yung white. We have the black and we have the brown. Yan. So, yung gray at saka beige, mga neutral colors din po yung mga yon. Then, we also have our primary colors. We have your yellow, we have your red, and we have your blue. Then, our secondary colors, we have your green, we have your violet, and we have your Orange. Now, pwede kang magkaroon ng complementary colors. Pag sabi ng complementary co colors, ito yung mga exact opposite para mag-stand out yung color natin. Then, we also have your analogous colors. Pag sabi ng analogous colors, ito po yung parang uh, mag-supplement sa isa't isa. No? So, for example, you have your uh, blue, you have your green, etc., etc. Then, you have also your... Um, monochromatic colors. Pag sabi monochromatic colors, isang color lang gagamitin pero iba-ibang shades and uh, ano po siya. Um, parang texture niya. No? So, yun. So, hindi po ako ganun ka-expert sa pagpipin because this is my first time. So, check natin kung paano po ba ang tamang pagpipin and kayo na pong magja-judge kung paano po ba yung aking painting. Yan. So, first is kunin natin yung canvas. Yan. Okay, so anong gagawin po natin dito sa canvas sheet na to? So, gagawin po natin dito, uh, kuko po tayo ng pencil and then, nalagay po natin dito kung ano po ba yung ating object, no? So, uh, are we going to paint uh, flowers, leaves, a landscape, or a portrait of a person, etc., etc., or animals? So, check natin kung paano. And then, after natin i-draw, doon natin ipipaint. Yan. So, dapat magdo-drawing muna before natin siya ipipaint. So, yan po. Tapos na po natin. 
yung ating pong um, pag-sketch gamit po yung ating pong um, pencil so ganito po yung kinalabasan niya no? pang bata lang siya kasi sa totoo lang po guys hindi po ako marunong mag-drawing wala pong ka-art-art sa katawan ko pero I'm trying my best and I'm a frustrated uh, artist gusto ko talaga maging painter no? so try muna natin sa basic yan. may sky sky and then merong mountain yan. so very basic lang po so tatry po natin to so magpapin na po tayo sa bundok pa rin po tayo inayos natin yung bundok syempre hindi naman dapat uh, walang cheese yung bundok kaya ganyan po yung itsura nya ok yan. so balikan natin mamaya bigyan natin ng konting perspective na ito naka front ito naka sa likod so yun para hindi sya magmukhang uh, plain yan Okay guys, so after nating ma-paint yung mountain, lilipat na po tayo ngayon sa sky. Okay, sa clouds. So ang gagawin po natin, dahil gagamitin po natin ulit yung ating mga brush, tip lang po, wag nyo muna pong uhugasan kapag nagpapalit na po kayo ng color. Ang gagawin po natin is pupunasan muna natin sila ng tissue. And then after mapunasan ng tissue, dun pa lang po dapat babanlawin ng tubig. Okay, so para hindi po magkahalo-halo yung mga colors. Huwag pong agad-agad isasalang sa tubig kapag magpapalit po ng color. So dapat punasan muna ng tissue. Okay, so let's start with the sky. So of course, kapag sky yan, unay natin yung color blue. Okay, so yung blue, mimix natin siya sa white. Okay, para hindi masyadong makulay. So medyo sky blue yung ating color so we will use the white and the blue and then yeah so basta dapat imimix yung blue at saka yung white wag yung pure blue so mamaya natin yung ilalagay kapag tayo ay magbe-blend na ng colors but currently we will use white and blue for the clouds A few inches later. Okay, so yan po yung atin pong uh, painting. And very simple lang siya pero merong konting uh, blending dun sa kanyang color no. So merong sky at meron po tayong uh, mountains. Hope you learned something from our video for today and sana nagustuhan niyo po yung aking pong first ever acrylic painting na ginawa. Okay, so nakaalis po siya ng stress and of course this is only one of the or the first of the uh, paintings that we will do in the future. So, sa mga hindi pa po nakasubscribe dyan, you can go to my YouTube channel, Patrick Kura, and abangan nyo po yung ating mga susunod videos. Good day!